Multiliters contain multiple leader lines so that one single note can point to multiple locations in a drawing. Multiliters provide more control and flexibility than a traditional leader. We can easily access the Multiliters toolbar from the toolbar menu. Choose Multiliter from the right click menu to display the Multiliter toolbar in the window. We can create multiliters by first specifying the leader head or the content. The right click menu enables you to select from each of these methods and the method we specify will remain persistent for the subsequent multiliters. We can add or remove a leader line. We can create a single leader object and then use mLeader Edit to add more leaders to point to multiple locations in the drawing. We can also use mLeader Edit to remove the leaders that we don't want to use anymore. If we grip edit the M leader, a different part will be maintained respectively between the leader and the text notes. With the new multi-leader style manager, we can create or modify multi-leader styles to control the appearance of multi-leaders. It is similar to defining dimension styles, table styles, and text styles as you can see here. We can specify the leader format. This includes the type of leader line and the type of arrowhead. We can specify the leader structure including constraints associate and the landing settings. We're able to specify the type of content as well. For example, we can choose to use the type of content with block instead of mText. Using multi-leaders with block is as quick and simple as using multi-leaders with mText. Add multi-leaders to the drawing and add more leaders to point to other locations. Block options make it easy to create bubble callouts. This can replace mText notes that are too long and are used too frequently. ZWCAD 2011 newly provides multi-leaders with lots of customized settings and offers more control and flexibility. This makes it easy for drafting work.